Now we've got to make some choices. Central Bellius PCA occupied base, the wall. Eliminate enemy squads. Eliminate the PCA enforcement squads. Central Icefield, Old Bertram Spaceport, Environs. Destroy enemy craft. Destroy the planetary closure admin special forces craft. Catch a prank. Okay, so I have got a question. If I do one, I don't get to do the other, is that right? Or is it just that there's a decision to be made within the mission that will affect stuff? Like, how does it work? Okay, if I do one, I don't get to do the other. specialized for ground combat. If we allow the corporations to seize this kind of technology, things will take a dire turn. We want you to deny them the opportunity. Destroy the weapon first. It has little legs in the middle. Cataphract is a moving fortress equipped with almost impenetrable armor. It incorporates a bipedal MT as its core, making it a highly versatile threat. That MT core is also its vulnerability. Focus your fire there, and it can be beaten. You're our best chance. What do you say? Let's review the other mission first. to choose which big boss monster I want to fight? Mmm, they spoiling me. I think I'm gonna do this one. I think I'm gonna do this one. Yeah. Cause that's that's a job that the 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 companies and stuff wanna wanna give, right? But this is a job that the uh, the Rubicons want you to do, if I understand that correctly. And I'm guessing the Rubicons are like the the people who actually live on the planet, um, but obviously it's being like invaded and pilfered for all sorts of materials and all that stuff. Boss is fun. And I'd rather do I'd rather do right by them. Seems the Liberation Front are hoping their rivals will wear each other down. They must be desperate to avoid confronting a triumphant victor. Look 
God damn it. Oh my gosh. Fine, I took that on purpose. Booyah! First try! Thank you, Jed. Thank you. It's clutch. Ah, <laughs> uh, there's a reason I got that Vanso. <laughs> you again. I'm a busy man. Far too busy for the likes of you. So I hear. Must be a tough time to be the Vesper's deputy commander. Get to the point. The plan to raid the PCA. You're going to need more pawns on the board. Of course. You're here to hawk your services again. Very well. I'll consider that mutt of yours part of the effort. One more thing. Show my hound some respect. Gen 4 is as good a pedigree as any other. Mm -hmm. Raven, thank you for taking the cataphract mission. Uncle Flatwell was pleased. He called you a valuable asset. With your help, maybe we can beat the corporations and the PCA. No, we need to stand on our own two feet. That's how we'll win. Um, so, for OS tuning, Vanser, I have... Where is it gone? Oh, here it is. It's terminal armor. So basically, when you would die, it, keep, it keeps you alive at like 1 HP. Attack the old spaceport. Attack the base seized by the planetary closure. Okay. Hey there, buddy. Got a request from Archibus for you. Here's the briefing from my CO, who came up with the plan. This is V2 Snail. I shall brief you on the operation. You will be under my direct authority. Consider it a rare privilege. We will conduct simultaneous surprise raids on two planetary closure administration bases. One is the Hall of Communications base, the relay for comms between enemy squads. The second is the former Bertram spaceport seized by the PCA for its suppression fleet. V4 Rusty will be dispatched to handle the Harlov base. His objective will be to disable their network and prevent support from PC elite squads. Raven, during this time you must destroy all the heavy warships berthed at the spaceport. 
That sounds fun. Would I recommend this for someone who's never played the series? There's a catch. Disruption of PCA comms won't last long. I'll come support you when I finish on my end. It's very good, Brabbit. Um, but the like be be warned, the difficulty of the bosses like spikes. I know I just melted that last one, but like on the very first level, I died twice to the first boss. And then when I got to like the second or third one, it's called Baltius, it's kind of famous. There have been a few people who have just quit the game because of the difficulty spike. Um if this mission succeeds, the corporations will deal the PCA. It is quite nice with It is quite nice with its checkpoints. Like, it will give you all of your heals, full health, ammunition, everything back. Um, if you if you die and continue from checkpoint. It also has a thing where it's like... Um, if you die and you're on the, like, the continue screen, you can change your loadout there and just continue from the checkpoint. The whole, like... Looking at the stats and the build stuff might be a little alienating but there's there's like if you hit the thumb pad it gives you a bit more there's like an option for contextual help and it'll give you like a bit more information on it it's a little hard for me to, to recommend to people who haven't played armored core before or I don't play many like difficult games Because I don't know, like, what that person's patience is going to be like, you know what I mean? Hey, buddy. I've taken out the relay mast. That takes care of their external comms for it's not. It's not that I doubt Keep people moving. will be able to, you know, Target succeed first. eventually. It's just... For me, it's like, okay, well, I don't care how hard this is, I'm going to see it through. But I, I don't know how other people are going to react to, to that. And so far, I've seen a lot of people have just kind of given up on the game. Well, not a lot, but there's definitely been a couple. Good measuring stick is after they played, ask, ask if they played Sekiro. Uh, yeah? Sure? Open fire! Keep the target away! Two more ships left. Oh, I'm out of juice. This way. Heavy warships incoming. 
<laughs> fat chance. He's like next generation. Uh, looks like we've got high ranking PCA officers. Sorry to keep you waiting. I've got your back, buddy. Hope you've got mine. Mm. Go double four. Send me what you've got on the target. These gats are so good. <laughs> Something's wrong. 
looks like the PCA has helped itself to the Institute's relics. 621, rest up at base. I'll come up with a plan to deal with our new friend. A new threat! Good job, me. Here's the situation, 621. After the PCA sicked that Institute weapon on us, Archibus and Balaam have moved to cooperate. IA-02, aka Iceworm. It's a sea weapon. An autonomous deterrent created to protect the coral. If we don't take it out, no one's going to reach the Convergence. We'll have a tough fight ahead of us, and everyone's getting involved. 621. Don't forget we've got a job to do on Rubicon. I didn't bring you all the way here for nothing. Messages. Three messages. I'm getting popular. Heard the news, tourist. Ice worm, huh? You just keep tripping up over the Institute's relics, don't you? Well, I got something that might interest you. Sent you a briefing. This is V8 Pater. Your performance in the spaceport raid was admirable. V2 and V4 left a message for you, but the arrival of that monster is a more pressing matter. Archibus and Balaam have agreed to a ceasefire and are looking to cooperate for the moment. It'll take time to formalize our agreement. For now, I've sent you another request. Registration number RB23. Call sign, Raven. Your records have been updated. B-rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. You have entered the upper ranks. May these encounters further guide your technique. Let's have a look, see. It's patches here. Wait, that's D. This is C, C, B. Kiefer, Cinder, Carla. Oh, you finally get to fight them. Cool. Cold Call, Rusty A. Rusty's high rank. Honest Brute. Hmm. Patches. Alright. What have we got? Eliminate Honest Brute. Defend the old spaceport. Historic Data Recovery. Do it. We need to finish this chapter today. I'll cut to the chase. This is about the ice worm. That institute relic you had a run-in with. The corpse might stand a chance if it were just the PCA they were teaming up against. But that monster is a whole other story. You can't just throw bodies at it. The thing that makes it such a pain in the ass is its perpetual reactive shield. Coral Tech. Takes advantage of the coral's directivity. Ordinary weapons can't touch it. So let's get extraordinary. I can make you something that'll punch a hole in that shield. But I'll need your help. Sounds fun. Grid 012. One of the first sectors they built. And it's barely holding up. That's where a little rat who betrayed R.A.D. is hiding out. Take care, Vansa. the name of Honest Brute. His AC, Milktooth, was built by us. So it's only flaws that it's piloted by him. <laughs> when he ran from R.A.D., he didn't just take credits in tech. He also took a secret project of mine. And that secret project is what we'll need to bust open the Ice Worm's shield. Hi, Cans. 
I have no idea what you're talking about, but hello. Hello, hello. You ready for this tourist? You know it. No one's gonna miss Brute. And we all stand to gain. Thank you, Vanessa. I'll tell you where to go. Welcome, tourist. It's a delight to enjoy the company of a visitor from so far away. Bruce, we're here to take back what you stole from us. Ow. Oh, heavens. You're a friend of Carla's. Splendid. Any friend of Carla's is a friend of mine. Here's to new beginnings. By all means, do my guest. See what I mean, tourist? We need to go deep down. You want to pop open for me? Like a kinder surprise? My toys like they were his. Ah, oh, snipers. Clear the laser sensors. They're set to activate the enemy machines. A new friend from afar just for me. What joy. Please kill my beating heart. See, spider fight was a piece of piss. I beat in like 20 minutes. I died a few times, but honestly, it was I killed it in about 20 minutes. It was a uh, not hard. Did you just just like go? Thank you, Izzy. That's very kind. Thank you. Vida Extra. Just gonna humble brag. Vida Extra, a Spanish, I think Spanish gaming news, um, called me the goat. What about the smart cleaner? Is that the. Oh, that's the thing with the furnace on its back. I killed that first try. I haven't used tetrapods. This, this what I'm using right now, this is all I've been using. Missile pods, double gats, bipedal. That's it. He's talking to his AC. I want it. I've done my best to welcome you. I do hope you'll enjoy your stay. Bad cook. Whatever that is. At fifty percent. Jump down there and we've got him cornered. Don't forget, the guy's a rat. This won't be smooth sailing. Is 
this place some kind of hangar? The target AC must be nearby. Oh, this is that thing that oh, my new friend. You're here at last. Brute. Oh, Carla, you've introduced me to such wonderful people. Wonderful things. So first. The sweet melody of the generator. How Milton's heart sings. Not that AC and our AD test. Don't underestimate it. AP at 50%. I'll tell you what else, Chaotic. I've not even been using the lock on. How milk tooth weeps. How the rail cannon weeps. Torn from their mother. How they must miss Carlos. I weep too. Not a bit. But AP had to slow. Slow. Quick, quick, slow. 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 Bad cook. And mind alpha. One new message. This is Chatty Stick, RAD. Thanks for putting down Brute. The Chief's already in the workshop tweaking the rail cannon. And I've never seen her happier to be at work. That is all. Later, tourist. <laughs> <laughs> 